Good morning guys, it's Laurie from Passionate Penny Pincher and I have a fantastic deal on these super cute kimonos that everyone needs one of for summer. They are $14.95 shipped with the code KIMONOPENNY at checkout. So if you click that link above, hopefully that will work. I see a few folks are hopping on guys. We had some problems a second ago with the video freezing. So let me know if you can give me some hearts or likes and comments and let me know if the video is working. I would so appreciate that this morning. Oh good, some hearts and likes, so that looks good. Um, my daughter Reagan is over here having cereal. As soon as she's finished and after I show you the kimonos, I'm gonna sh we are gonna tackle this awful cabinet that has been driving me crazy. I've actually had this cabinet now in two houses, so today I'm gonna tackle it and make it better. Okay, so it looks like things are working. Hannah, it looks like you're able to post. There's hearts and likes. You can see Reagan checking herself out in the mirror. Yep, that's what we do here. Okay, looks like everything's working. Is everything working? I haven't seen comments. Leave me a comment. Tell me this morning where you're at. Tell me what you are doing today, and then I have a big giveaway also as well. I'm gonna tell you about these. Reagan, you wanna say hi? There she is. Good morning. I'm going to tell you about these kimonos, but Sense of Style has said for every 100 shares they get, up to two, they are going to give us a huge, super cute beach blanket. I am obsessed with these beach blankets to give away. So if you will hit that share button, um, anyone who hits the share this button will be entered to win the giveaway. So I would love for that to happen. I am not seeing any comments here on this side. Hannah, I'm hoping y'all are here. I don't see any comments at all. Oh wait, there's the comments. Yay, working. Oh good, working, working. There we go. Now I'm seeing comments. Awesome. Okay, so let me show you these kimonos. I'm gonna kind of turn this around. Hey Reagan, don't get into that mess yet. Okay, so here I'm gonna put this down here so you can hopefully try to figure out how to make you see them. Okay, can y'all see these? So these are $14.95. That's really hard to see, isn't it? I may have to move this video. Um, Somebody says they're working today. Katie, you are cleaning in your living room. Yeah, fun things. At least if you're cleaning, you can get it done. Oh, thank you, Carla, for sharing. I'm going to try to scoot this thing down so y'all can look at this top. It's a cleaning day, too. Anybody else who's cleaning? Awesome. I'm so glad I'm not the only one. We'll take a break to check out these cute kimonos because they are $14.95, and I love them. So this is one of them. Y'all, look at how cute this is. I really wish I could do a better job showing it to you. But it's $14.97, and what I love about these is if you're like me and you're a little self-conscious about your arms and don't, but you also want to be cooler in the summertime, these are fabulous. Oh, here, there we go. There's the right height. Okay, so do y'all see that? They are $14.95 shipped, and I love they are super cool. Like I am not hot. You can see they're super, super thin. I just put mine on over a Literally, it's on over a $2 tank from Old Navy. So literally, super reasonable top outfit with some jeans, um, capris. You wear shorts. I'm actually going to wear one to the pool today. Um, yeah, so $14.97. So I'm going to show you a couple other ones. The ones that are on sale over there, and I'm going to scoot out so I can take off my tank because I'm too self-conscious to show my arms here in front of the world. Um, this is another one. The two favorites that I liked were the Monty and the Ray. Look at how cute these are, guys. Like, all you need is a super cute tank, any tank, um, and then just pull to, and it makes you just, it kind of covers up the gunk underneath <laughs> if you feel like you've got some stuff, some fluff that's there. What's also one size fits all, so um, it's super, you can see there, it's plenty roomy. Um, I am a pretty traditional size medium. Um, I feel very fine in this, but I also think it would be great if you're smaller, if you're larger. It's so cute. So $14.97. Use the code KimonoPenny at checkout. When we get 100 shares, we will give away a beach round. Um, so yeah, do that. I'm going to show you the last one. This was actually mine from last summer. They don't have this one this summer, but I love it. The two that I loved, again, are the Monty and the Ray. So check those out. Um, yeah, and they're $14.97. You can't beat that. And if you struggle with feeling, you know, like you want to be cooler in the summertime and you want to wear something summery but you don't want to necessarily show off your arms, you want to feel covered, I this is my favorite one. Look how cute this one is. And look at the back of this one. I think the Monty has a really cool back. Um, yeah, so definitely I appreciate y'all sharing that. Good morning, Courtney. Glad to see you. So if you have any questions about these, I just think for $14.97, you really can't beat them. And um, 
yeah they're super cute so the pink one is not available all the ones I think over there are blue and white and all you gotta do is click that link and you will get it thank you for sharing when we hit 100 shares they have these gorgeous if you go to sense of style they have these gorgeous massive beach rounds um, that are like $39.97 I think right now but they're gonna give away two of them so Rhonda if you're interested click the link right there so if and if you go to the link and you're looking for the beach rounds that we're giving away if you go to seasonal it's gonna show you those they are so cute um, oh Deborah you want me to back up again yeah let me back up so yeah I'll back up so you can see here we go does that help oh Reagan's here come here Reagan's gonna show hers come here babe <laughs> she feels silly okay so this is like come over here so they can see because I actually need to put that one back on this one is definitely on sale and look and it's actually kind of cute on you come show them go go over here come here silly goose <laughs> there too big it is too big but you can see how the sizing is super generous so um, you, there's plenty of room if you need it but there's also if you're it, it flows down to however your size so it fits really really well thank you sue for sharing like i said anyone who shares will be entered to win the beach towel giveaway okay let me put that one back on here you switch come over here and sing a song or something go do something while i turn this off go over there run over and say hi to them while i put this one back on and then we're going to work on this cabinet oh my goodness hang on just a second hang on guys i'm putting the janice back on okay here we go so this is the last one yeah she's adorable she's looking at the cabinet that we're about to clean we are gonna clean that cabinet in just a second so here we go guys what do y'all think I mean and this is great this one I love the colors they're all great for 4th of July so if you go to 4th of July parades if you're gonna be outside but you want something really cool but covered it's you like you're you're literally just wearing a tank it feels very light it's not heavy um, they typically are $30 plus shipping right now $14.97 shipped with the code. Yeah, I love this one Victoria and this one is still included this one is available right now So if you like this one, I will also tell you lengthwise um, You can kind of see how tall it how long it goes. So it goes down to about Just above my knees. I'm 5'7. So to give you an idea of how tall um, Not with Capri's Valerie. I almost didn't wear it with capris this morning because I thought the same thing, but I was it's warm outside and I'm not I didn't want to change again I also do love the idea of wearing it to the pool as a cover-up and that's what I will be doing today So thank y'all so much for sharing it. I really appreciate it So how many of you guys would love to see my messy cupboard? I have to tell you a secret I have this in both houses both of the last two houses we have I've had a corner cabinet that has always been a mess I'm looking at the corner cabinet right now it's ridiculous I don't know what my problem is but I cannot get it together someone says that um, the shipping code that you don't need a code for shipping the only code you need is kimono k-i-m-o-n-o -O, penny all one word kimono penny and um, that'll get you free shipping as well so okay so this cupboard sits in my corner and I had it in the last house that we had and I throw stuff in it and it's a disaster it is my biggest disaster ever so we're gonna walk over and Reagan is gonna help me as she's putting on her kimono right now and she's gonna help me no baby she's putting it on y'all look here there's Reagan there she is putting it on okay we're gonna go to this cabinet you don't know how to put it on we're gonna go and we're gonna deal with this cabinet which I'm having issues with my silly thing thank y'all for sharing the video I so appreciate that and we will get you entered to win that beach towel which would be so fun let's see I'm gonna be this is not working very well today on my video is it let's see it keeps popping down so here we go here's the cabinet that we hate are we ready okay Reagan are you gonna help me do this cabinet she is like dancing around in the kimono right now hang on guys oh I cannot get this video for the life of me to say where it's supposed to go here let's see if we can I'm gonna turn that and I'm gonna turn this okay that's what we're cleaning today Reagan are you gonna climb up there and we're gonna do it so if you have a cabinet at home that is driving you nuts I want you to walk over to your cabinet right now this is the one that I had planned on doing during um, be awesome in April and we did not do it so we are gonna clean it out guys it is bad go ahead and just climb up on the countertop baby she's gonna help us by starting at the top here goes Reagan here we go if we can do this you can do this Turn to the side so they can see what you're cleaning. Here, can you scoot to one side? <laughs> Don't fall. She's not going to fall, I promise. 
So we have, let's just start pulling everything out. So let's start looking at it. We have an egomatic someone brought us for Easter. We are throwing this. We're not going to throw it away, but we're going to put it somewhere else. Oh, we have a cute, this is backwards, but it says keep calm and carry on sign. I forgot we had that. That can go maybe to someone's room. I don't know how long I'm going to Guys, I have not been up into, I have no idea what is in this cabinet that we are cleaning out today. Oh, this was a craft idea I had a long time ago. Um, huh, that's a cute frame. I need to do that. Yeah, who else is on the other side of the screen and needs to be cleaning something out today? Y'all clean something out today. Oh, this is a cute piggy trinket. Trivet, Caroline made. Yeah. This is my Uber junk cabinet. It's just yes. <laughs> junk. Oh, and this says Happy Mother's Day. Who else has a cabinet like this at home that needs some cleaning? I want you to go to your cabinet right now. I want you to start pulling out your stuff, and we're going to get it cleaned up. I know what that is. Let me see. These are, these are some plates that my sweet mother in law gave us years and years ago, and they really are beautiful. They're beautiful. Y'all look at these. Beautiful plates. But I've had them for... 22 years and they have never come out of the box. So who says, give me a heart or like if you think I need to get rid of these plates. They really are cute though. Gosh, they really are so cute. Oh dear. Oh look. And there's Christmas plates too that I forgot I even had. Yeah. Keep pulling stuff down. Hang on. Who says I need, y'all give me a heart or like if I need to get rid of these plates. Is mine? Give me, I guess, a heart to say get rid of and a like to say keep. So give me a like if you think I should keep them. I think I'm gonna get rid of Mom. these, which is gonna be really hard. Here's some more kids' trivets. Happy Mother's Day 2010. Yeah, we're gonna get rid of this. Use them for dessert. Uh, that's an idea. Oh look, Franken. Okay, come on. Keep we're gonna up, we're gonna keep it. Oh Merry Christmas 2012 from Reagan. Who else has these? We're gonna get these cabinets clean today. This has been sitting on my to-do list. This is oh I like this. Okay, so here, I'm keeping this. This is a dollar. And it came from the Dollar Tree, and I like to put flowers in it. So I'm totally keeping that, but I'm going to get it organized. Okay, just give me everything. Just keep passing. Come on. <laughs> Pass me the stuff. Okay, this is a canning jar. So we're going to keep a lot of this, but we're going to get it organized. Oh, I haven't seen those in forever. There's a summer plate that we used in the summertime, but I haven't pulled out yet this year. Oh, who has any of this? Do you have any of this? This is Bybee Pottery. Tell me who knows this. Yeah, I'm definitely keeping all the trivets. They won't be going anywhere. Y'all think keep the plates? Yeah. Y'all are saying don't give stuff up. If you haven't used it in a year, goodbye. These Bybee dishes are my favorites, and I'm totally keeping them. Plate with goodies for friends to church. The best idea ever is not to have kids around. You're right, and if she was at school, I would not have that. <laughs> okay, we bought this at Epcot. And I thought it was really cool. I am not a clutter bug. Like, this is my clutter area in my kitchen. But I bought it at Epcot, and I thought it would be cool to have a dinner bell to ring for my kids. Yeah. I love that, Deborah. I do not need to have kids around. This, who has one of these at home? Garage sale. Yeah, I think I need to garage sale this whole cabinet. Um, this is my You Are Special Today plate. I love this. This is the red plate that when they're special... Um, like if they do something cool at school, we kind of let them eat off that plate. This is a glass pitcher that we got from William Sonoma 22 years ago, and I will keep forever because we actually do use that. <laughs> this was a craft project last year on Passionate Penny Pitcher. That's going in the trash bag for sure. Okay, keep coming. Another one of mine. Another trivet. Lots 2009. Of, look, that's her in 2009, y'all. How cute is that? That's so me cute. two years Okay, old. keep passing. Keep passing. No, and by the way, guys, for those of you who want to check out the kimonos, I'll show those again at the end. I think I'm going to throw away these. These were our Easter craft this year. I think I'm going to throw those out so I can live without them. Oh, that's a cute bell. There's a cute bell. No idea how long I've had that or why I've kept that. Another glass jar. Go fast, go fast, go fast, go fast. <laughs> hurry, hurry. They don't want to sit here all day. Okay, more Bybee pottery. I love Bybee. I love it. Grandpa. Put the egg bell by the door. Take pictures of the trivets and then donate. This is kind of a cool thing that we'll keep forever. I love this. So this was an old Beautiful. piece of pottery that someone found for my husband's. It's like, let's see. Y'all don't need to know our history. But anyways, it's old and I'm keeping that one for sure. Oh, this is why I can't get rid of things. I'm getting rid of this thing because I don't know what it is. Y'all, does that have any huge value right there? I'm not sure that it does. 
You love so the pottery. I love the Bybee pottery. I am a Bybee pottery addict, and I'm sad that they closed their store in Bybee, Kentucky. Um, that's a whole other blog post right there. It's a pretty awesome place where you could go and get a Ooh, ton of pottery super cheap. Oh, there's a candle, a mistletoe candle. Hmm. Okay, keep coming. Candy. How many of y'all have this candy, little candy things? Okay, keep coming out. Oh, another PPP craft project that was not, didn't work. It worked really cute on the pink side, not on this side. I'm keeping the trivets. I don't think I can get those. Um, and yes, by throwing it out, I mean take to Goodwill if it's at all usable by somebody. If it's not usable by anyone, I won't take it to Goodwill. Oh, look here. More plates. Uh, what do y'all do with this stuff? What do you do with this stuff? This is a really cute plate, but I have nothing in my house that's that color. Like, what do you do? I probably will donate them. Uh, oh, look, this is Christmas 1970. Someone gave this to us. Christmas 1970. I feel like I don't want to get rid of stuff that could potentially have value, which is why. Oh, and I actually love these plates, but I don't do anything with them. Get, what do you think about these? These are, Mom, I need to find out if these have any value. Grandma's house. Yeah, I'm keeping those. These are Dutch Def Blue of Holland of Michigan. I probably have to keep that set because I do like those. Okay, I have a thing for Navy. This is a thing of, this is another Passionate Penny Pincher craft project. Do you have a display cabinet? I don't have a display cabinet. That would be fantastic. Oh, look, there's Nerds. Oh. I found a whole pack of Reagan them. found more. Okay, I'm just going to set those there. Yeah, keep coming. Okay, I'll put them right here. Okay. She has a candy stash she's keeping. Make bird feeders? How do you make bird feeders? Gift plates with cookies on them. I like that idea. That's a great idea. These are from last Christmas. I'm, this was our, look at that. Okay, you're getting on the ladder. I'm going to throw away this candy. I'm this is, oh gosh, this is good. Now we're getting to the bad shelf. She did pretty good. Now we're on the dirty shelf. Um, just start handing. Just start handing. Oh, she's going to find all the candy. I love candy. More candy in a bag. Who else has this? Guys, if you're watching this, I want you to hop off and I want you to go and do this. And if you're watching, huh, this is, goes to the top of my KitchenAid. I've never once used this. Who uses this on their KitchenAid? I don't know what to do with this. Um, oh, and it's on my smaller KitchenAid. Huh. I think I'm going to go take that to the basement where it belongs. Wouldn't it be nice to have a usable cabinet? Turn around, baby. Let me see what you got. Don't eat the candy. Come on. Come on. Let me see stuff. Seriously. Oh, this is some more mason jars. You do use yours on your KitchenAid. What are those? Oh, yeah. These are super cute plates. Oh, look. There's matches. I've been out of matches. Super cute plates. I'm going to go and organize Here, these. You know, I think a lot of this... Oh, yeah, look. Guys, look at these. These were super cute. These were from Hobby Lobby, and they were great for a tea party. So we did them like that for a tea party. So cute. Sherry, you threw your topper away, the splash guard. You use yours every time, Jennifer. You use the flower guard all the time. I never use the... In fact, I didn't even know it was called a flower guard. Okay, this actually goes up in here, so we're going to put that away right now. Oh, I bought these at Hobby Lobby and thought I would use them, and they have never been used. They're just sitting up here. Guys, I promise I am not a hoarder. This is, this is my one grade. cabinet. Uh, this is Reagan, and she says, <laughs> she says, I love my mom because she makes sure I get enough sleep. Okay, keep going, keep going. We're going to get through this cabinet. Come on, we got to get it done. Grade. We're getting it done. Okay, that's okay. just a plate. Just go fast, go fast. Oh, what's this? Uh-oh. Oh, okay, so at, look at this, y'all. At Halloween, whenever we have extra candy, it goes in here. And, yeah, that's where it's gone. So there's a whole bunch of extra candy that probably we haven't eaten in forever. I'm eating it. I should never let you see this cabinet. <laughs> Let's keep going. Um, guys, if you're watching this and you are bored out of your mind, I want you to take this with you if you'd like and keep watching. Oh, no, no, someone will eat that, baby. Let's do that. Okay. Um. I want you to take the phone with you, and I want you to clean something out in your house and tell me what you're cleaning. Okay. Keep coming. Keep coming. Yeah, that's, that can be thrown away for sure. There's candy. Okay, just go fast. Go fast. Go fast. Go fast. Focus. We're going to get this done as fast as you can. Oh, this was a pie plate from Michael's that I thought I would chalk paint, and the chalk paint came off. Yeah. 
we're gonna get rid of that. Use the extra candy. Oh, that's a great idea to use the extra candy to make gingerbread houses. I love oh. it. Keep passing. Keep that passing. Extra candy. Another blue thing. If anybody needs blue so stuff, okay. I guess come on this over to my house. Okay, let's throw it away. Come on, fast, fast, fast. Go, go, go. Ooh, a water bottle. A water bottle that probably works. Awesome. Okay, sprinkles. Let's scoot. Huh. More sprinkles. More sprinkles. Why are the sprinkles in here? I don't know how. We have a sprinkle area, and I guess they find their own place. I'm reading your comments. Your three-year-old Rochelle loves to see Reagan. Do you want to Reagan? You want to look over and say hi? <laughs> okay. Come on. Let's candy. get this. More candy. This is old candy, though. No, this. Karen's gonna use them. They're old. They're nasty. She has pens. Okay. Keep pulling stuff out. Fast, fast, fast. How are you doing? The chocolate chips are just in Oh, y'all. This is bad. Okay, this is another piece. Y'all can tell I love this Bybee. Look at this. Um, and the goal today was really just to clean out the cabinets and then to show you these cute kimonos. So I'll, while Reagan's pulling stuff down, I'll show you the cute kimonos again. And then um, we will finish cleaning. Keep pulling everything out, babe, and I'll show them the cute kimonos. And if you share the video, you'll be entered to win one of the beach rounds from... Um, sense of style. So that's what I'll do is I'll show you all the kimonos real fast for those of you who hopped on late. So Reagan's going to keep working over there on the kimonos. We're on that here. I guess I should let y'all see her, huh? Okay, here we go. So this is just a fun day of getting a cabinet cleaned out because I needed some inspiration to get it done. And so I figured I could do that with you guys. Okay, so here is the kimono and it's not going to look very good that way. Let me see. I have to turn it a little bit down. Reagan, keep pulling everything out. Just keep pulling stuff out. Look You're doing awesome. You don't have a cabinet collection? No. Rebecca, I have this one no. cabinet and it's awful. No. Yes, baby. I know. It's so cute. Okay, so here's the kimono again. And they, you can, these are on sale for... Another big base. These are on sale for $14.95 with the code PP... I'm sorry, with the code kimono penny. Just put it down there at checkout. So I want to show you guys these while she keeps cleaning. Um, they are so cute. If you've been wait, looking for a deal on one, um, this is a great deal. Here's this one and I'll show, I'm not even going to show you. They come in lots of different colors and if you click the link above, that will take you to them. Someone asked what the point of today is. I really wanted to show you the kimonos and I wanted to get my cabinet cleaned out. Facebook apparently says video is better when it's longer. So I feel like it's way too long, and I know I would get bored if I were you guys. So I hope that if you're on the other side of the screen, that you will score a great deal on a kimono, and then um, maybe clean out your cabinet too. So yeah, these are the kimonos though. Aren't they cute? Like so cute and perfect in the summertime. So perfect to cover up your arms and feel really cute in. Cindy, it's a rainy day project. It is a rainy day project. It's not a project for today. Look at her still cleaning. She's doing awesome over there. I'm going to see if y'all have any other questions. Another one done? It's a bad one. That's the bad one. Yeah. Aren't these cute? I think these are so cute. So use the code if you're interested in them. Use the code Kimono Penny. Oh, so um, I'm going to show you the pink one too because it's just so darn cute. Yeah. Can you borrow Reagan? You can totally. In fact, Reagan, someone wants to know if they can borrow you. Tell them how much you charge me. Ten bucks. She tries to charge me ten dollars to do a Facebook Live video with like me. She would like a hundred. Hundred's not happening. Ten dollars basically may not even happen either. Okay. Here's the other Kimono which I love this one. And the one that is most like this one to me, I think is the Monty. Um, and it's still there. This one was from last summer, but I love it. And you can use the code Kimono Penny at checkout to get it for $14.95 plus free shipping. Yeah. Please come in. Oh, <laughs> this is bad. Okay. So we're going to go back over here and we're going to pay her in candy. Stacy. Oh my gosh. Starlene, the store is from Sense of Style. And if you click the link above, you will totally get that. Okay. Here's pay ten dollars in candy we're not gonna pay ten dollars and remember if you hit the share this button we will enter you to win a beach round okay so let's get through this last cabinet thank you for sharing Gloria I appreciate it okay we're gonna go on through oh guys we're on this last cabinet look how lovely it looks with everything out though okay well, why don't you let me finish this let me finish this one up let me finish this yeah let me here scoot up scoot 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 Scoot, scoot, scoot. This is my hiding place for my dark chocolate, too. So, <laughs> Carol Reagan's going to show you that I have a dark chocolate addiction. And so, that's where it all goes. Okay. So, 
Throw or toss, guys. What do you think? Halloween plates. My kids no longer use these. I do think they're I, so cute. They're from them. Target. You love them. You should give them to Miss Melanie. I should give them. Miss Melanie needs those. She I'm sure those types really A candy good. corn thing. Yeah. Summer. I'm going to see how fast I can get this back in order now that we've been on way too long today. Oh, gosh. Can you grab... No, I'm not really good at grabbing things. Okay. Fine. Guys, this is just a mess. This is my one cabinet in every box that I have. It is just a mess. My crystallite stuff. Yeah. It's bad. This is just bad. My daughter's thankful thing from last Thanksgiving. I don't know why everything ends up here. Ooh, extra dark chocolate. This is terrible. A stray M and M. Who else has a cabinet like this, guys? If you have a cabinet like this Look and you want to get it cleaned out, I encourage you just to tackle it today, guys. This is ridiculous. I have, I have scrapbook stickers. I haven't scrapbooked like that in years. Okay, so I'm throwing more stuff away. Hey, Ray, you need to stop, baby. Oh, 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 this is a great idea. This is a great idea. If you have kids, this is the um, Fruit of the Spirit jar. You want to tell them the Fruits of the Spirit? And they love the Fruit of the Spirit jar because whenever no, I, I see them it's doing the something candy. good, the well, candy. but the candy's not good bad. Um, but can you tell them what the Fruit of the Spirit is? Can you tell them? Do you the remember? The Fruit of the Spirit is love, joy, peace, patience, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. Galatians 5, 22. And so what happens when you do something like that? But can you explain how it works, how the Fruit of the Spirit jar works? Here, you want to show it, talk to him about it? Here, you can come down and talk to him. Here. So we basically had a jar with this on it. And every time we would do something good or be, be able to say this, we would get a choose candy. And it was usually like a jar. fruit colored candy. Yeah. So do you still remember the Fruits of the Spirit? And they had to say the Fruits of the Spirit. So what did you say? Well, that wasn't awesome. Oh, man. I'll go, yeah, go get the sweeper. Actually, just stay over there. Yeah. Oh, that wasn't good. Ugh. Well, you know, on Facebook Live, it all happens for real. You know what I'm going to do, guys, is I'm going to finish cleaning this out. I'm going to clean up the stuff that just dropped. Thankfully, we have shoes on. And then I'm going to take a picture of the after because, yeah, it's bad. Which one was it? It was this one. Yeah, it's gone. Anyways, if you need some inspiration to get some cleaning done today, this is a great time to tackle it because if you're like me, this is a cabinet that obviously needed some attention. Um, yeah, what broke? Deborah, the glass broke. One of these little cups. Sadness, right? So sad. Anyways, one last thing to store. You're right, Victoria. So I'm going to go through and I'm going to clean this. I'm going to finish cleaning this out here in just a second. I'm going to show you the kimonos one more time and I'm going to hop off. Oh, Reagan's coming over to sweep. Thank you, baby. She put her shoes on first, though. Smart kid that she is. Actually, it's just Carolyn's. But okay. So she's going to sweep. It's okay, Victoria. It's all small stuff. You know, the thing is, it's all stuff, and it doesn't matter. Julie, that's a great idea to donate to a local um, women's shelter. So if you need to get something clean today, I encourage you to get that done. Marnie, I am totally okay. I'm not a stuff person, really. So it was probably just stuff I needed to get rid of anyway. So it's okay. No big deal. Small stuff, for sure. Okay. <laughs> Let me tell you about the kimonos one more time. And then I'm gonna hop off. I'm gonna finish cleaning this disastrous cabinet. I hope that you're encouraged to tackle a project in your home. If you have felt overwhelmed by your house, you know that getting something cleaned up will feel, make you feel better. Um, yeah, so it's gonna, we're gonna get this one done and you're gonna hopefully get something done. Let me show you real fast the kimonos one more time. They are 50% off plus free shipping with the code PPP, I'm sorry, with the code kimono. Penny, K-I-M-O-N-O, -O, Penny, at checkout. Um, I'm so glad, Patty, thank you for letting me know that I'm not the only one who has a mess in my house somewhere. And thank you, Kathy, I love that table too. It came from um, Hobby Lobby, so yeah, I like it. I like it a whole lot, it was super inexpensive. Um, where'd my other kimono go, Miss Reagan? Reagan, do not hurt yourself in the glass, baby. Oh, here's the other kimono, and this one is still available. Can you open the trash? You can open it. Yeah, you got it, baby. And we're going to finish up cleaning our cabinet, and I will take a picture of the before and after and let y'all see the mess with us. Um, 
And yes, Pat, I think it's bizarre that people get on watch line to watch people clean stuff, but by far, that's one of the most watched videos that we do is when we clean a cabinet. And so I hope if people are watching it that they don't sit here and watch me do mine, but that they take the phone with them and maybe clean up as well. So yeah. Thank you, Jane. I'm glad I'm not the only one. Okay, so kimono, use the code kimono penny at checkout. Um, I will take a before and after picture and show you guys what our cabinet looks like in 30 minutes when it's going to be glorious, I'm sure. Hope you guys have the best day. Have a fantastic weekend. I will talk to you soon. Bye-bye.